Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is November 3 and since the Halloween is over, this is the time that I've been waiting for. So as you can see at my back, I'm starting to put up my Christmas tree. Well, I forgot to turn on the camera first before I start putting it up. So I remember I have to show you guys. I'm just going to continue putting this up and let's go. And that's it, our seven foot sling Christmas tree. Look, it's like touching the ceiling because we have a low ceiling here. So it's almost touching it. It's as high as our ceiling.
so I just done putting all the lights yesterday so I decided to put some blue lights since my theme this year is gonna be blue teal and silver and I think that it's gonna be a nice touch up with the lights since it's gonna go and you know blend well with the decoration so I have a I put so I put 200 blue lights in it I have uh, 450 uh, white lights it's gonna be my uh, color theme for this year so all these right here all this teal and like white are new but I didn't bought them um, recently I bought them last year after Christmas because you know uh, if you want to save a lot of money you should get them after Christmas because most of them are 70% off so you saving a lot of money this is like a shell like white teal and white silver ribbons these are all um, Christmas balls I have trimmery here snowflakes white snowflakes silver and teal or um, what are these trimmery here big balls big balls and more trimmery this one is like you know uh, kind of glass or plastic but they can break if you if it if you um, drop them on the floor these ones right over here these are silver these are all from last year that i'm still gonna use now but i'm not sure if, it, if i'm gonna use the bird but you know we'll see it depends on how the tree will looks like after these are also from last year uh, i'm not gonna use the black balls just the silver it's gonna be my starting um stuff for decoration so i'm excited and let's do it
so this is the finished product so I end up adding more ornaments because I overlooked the box where I put the ornaments and I've realized I have some accent ornaments that I overlook inside the box so I have some more uh, trimmery here it looks like it actually looks like cotton balls with like um, that sparkle so that and some more trimmeries up here the silver ones these are the, some of the accent uh, ornaments that I had that and some here at the bottom like this and this uh, glass seashells kind of ornaments so I put them right here at the bottom so that's it that's the finished product that's my frozen inspired Christmas tree in blue teal white and silver isn't that look pretty turn on the light in three two one there I actually need to replace the tree topper because that one is from last year and it's multicolored and it don't match the Christmas tree so I, I will get something that is either plain white or like a teal light if I can find one so it matches the tree but for now yeah I can leave with that but I'm gonna replace it soon so that's how my tree looks like when it's lit like legit like down here are the Christmas yarn balls that I made last year turn off the light in three two one yay so you can see the blue ball so you can see the blue lights kind of nice really looks pretty so there I'm proud of our Christmas tree it looks so pretty and nice and I actually have some other home Christmas decoration that I make but I'm gonna reveal that in my next video but for now I'm focusing on this, this Christmas tree that I make looks so pretty